Frodo saw him to the door. He gave a final wave of his hand and walked off at a surprising pace. But Frodo thought the old wizard looked unusually bent, almost as if he was carrying a great weight. The evening was closing in, and his cloaked figure quickly vanished into the twilight. Frodo did not see him again for a long time. Chapter 2 The Shadow of the Past The talk did not die down in night. So I was hoping that we could kind of hash out ideas today and, and we could work from there. Yeah, sounds good to me. All right, uh, <laughs> what genre are you thinking? Um, I'm kind of feeling horror. I feel that's easy enough to write. Yeah, horror is great. Uh, you got a couple of subgenres in there though. You've got a uh, thriller, you've got suspense, you've got... Uh, I was thinking supernatural. No, kind of being haunted by a malevolent spirit vibe. I like that. <laughs> I kind of wrote a rough draft. Well, more like a rough summary that I wanted you to see. Just now, give me some advice. Oh, yeah, let's see it. All right, let's see here. Uh, all right. Okay. All right, yeah, this seems doable. Great story, by the way. Love the, love the outline for it. Um, have you, have you structured it yet? Have you gone through like the three act structure and all that? Oh, no, not, not, not yet. That's what I wanted your help with. <laughs> oh. <laughs> so, I was wondering, would you mind writing the rough drafts? You know, because I trust your screenplay writing skills more than mine. Plus, I wouldn't know where to begin. <laughs> So. Okay. Yeah, I can. Yeah, I could totally help you with that. Let's let's go for it, man. Let's totally go for it. Uh, do you want to send notes back and forth and do it that way? Well, I was kind of hoping that you will be the main screenplay writer. Oh. Again, I trust your skills more than mine. That way, it'll have a consistent voice, you know. Yeah, I got you. Totally. That works. Okay. So you're writing. I mean, y yeah, I'm, yeah, I'm kind of writing it, yeah, I guess, I guess. Do you want to write it? I mean, I like writing, and I want to help, so... Right, right, right. But do you want to write it? I see what you're getting at. Spirit's at Killer Shack. She's chasing the Meg. Cool. Jen's at 80%. But yeah, do what's best for you. It's just, what am I supposed to say to him? 
No, I don't want to write your story for you. Yes. yes. Cool. Thanks. She gave up. She's starting to face towards you guys. Got it. Thanks. I, I just don't want to be harsh about it, you know? He's someone I might want to work with in the future. And it's good practice for writing something with someone. And I don't want to be the cause of it not getting done, you know? Jack, if it doesn't get done because you, someone who's not really interested in it in the first place, doesn't write it, that's not your fault. If he wants it done, he'll get it done. Yeah. Is it even a good story? It can be a good story. Wow, that sounds like a really dumb story. He doesn't believe you. Uh, cool. Um, I feel like he's someone we can't bribe. I mean, we can always try. True, but you know what I mean. Uh, I could always try to cast a sleep spell on him. Are there any guards around? No, there are not. Twenty-seven. Oh, so you're doing this like you did before? Mm -hmm. Oh, okay, cool. Uh, okay, okay. Um, oh, okay. As you see the guard, as you see the guard start to argue with Theron, right? You see Willow raise up her hand and wave it in front of her face. Oh, do you want style? Uh, muttering the incantation under her breath, you see the guard starts to go. What do you? What do you think you're doing? Before his speech slurs, his eyelids start to sink, and then... Oh, he's out. What do you do now? I rob him. <laughs> Every time. Jeez. <laughs> 